hello guys welcome back to my channel today i'll be walking you through a stage 3 remap on a smart 4 2 2009 so we're going to go ahead and open ecm titanium click on browse and locate the original file And we're going to double click or click open on the file to load it onto the system. Click no. And it will go into the automatic search. Once the system finds the correct ECU for it, double click the first one and click no and that will show you all of the maps like I've showed you in previous videos we're gonna open the percentage charts for the increase that we that we're gonna add to this map this one is stage 3 so let me just highlight that we'll do torque limiter first because the percentage is already high so 45% increase for the torque so if we go back here and go on torque limiter double click to go onto it take the percentage to 45 click the percent button and select all of the load and press page up that increases all of the values and now we'll close this and move on to the last one and we're going to do the same thing here press enter to go onto the map select all of it make sure the percent button is selected and if you look carefully this one is 1180 this one is 1888 if i press page up you'll see all of the values have increased throughout the map so that's confirmation that it has been increased by 45 percent we can now close this and we'll go back to the start onto injection we'll take the percentage down Injection is going to be increased by 10%, so we'll go back and make sure we press the percent button and select the data that we're working on. For this one, I'll keep it at 1% because there's not enough data to take increase it by 0 0.5 each time, and we'll just give it a 1% increase with each selection. So that we can get it up to 10% and once that's done we can move on to the next map Once that's ready you can close this and move on to the next injection map and we're going to do the same thing here select it from 19 to 1000 press the percent button and press page up and follow through with the rest of the data Now that that's ready we can close this and move on to the next one. Next we have phase of injection, we'll do the same thing here as well. So we select it from 999 revs to 21 load. Select the data, press the percent button and page up. And same thing and just follow through and keep pressing page up with the rest of the data as we move on.
once that's done we can close this and move on to the next selection of maps which is the rail pressure rail pressure we're increasing by five percent so if i open rail pressure we'll take the percentage down to 0 0.5 and select the data and give it a 0 0.5 percent increase That's ready and now we'll go on to the next rail pressure map and exact same thing here select the load and the RPM make sure you have the percent button selected press page up and keep going through the data Now that that's ready we can move on to the next selection which is fuel fuel we're increasing by six percent so we'll go onto the map press enter take the percentage up to one press the percent button so that it's selected and select the load of the map press page up to increase the values Once you've got 6% you can close this and move on to the next bit. Next we've got the turbo pressure. Turbo pressure limiters we're increasing to 12%. So we'll go on to this and keep the percentage at 1. Press the percent button and select the data. And press page up. That's a 12% increase altogether and we can move on to the next one. For this one we'll make the percentage 1.5. we can fit seven increases of data here so we'll stick to that and we we'll press the percent button and press page up and do the same for the next and so on Once that's done, we can move on to the next one, which is the pressure limiter. And here we're going to increase about 2%. So press page up and keep going until you've got 2 12%. Once that's completed, that's your whole map ready and you can save it. Click no 
click yes to export the modified file take it to the main folder and you can change the name here and we'll save this as the power mod and we can open up the folder just to double check and the file is here and as you can see it's the same file size as the original which is 2 megabytes once that's done you're ready to go and the file is ready to be put into the car make sure to like the video leave a comment if you have any suggestions and subscribe to our channel and make sure you click the bell icon to get regular notifications of our new uploads thank you